our work focuses is on, in on these disseminated tumor cells. And, um, and basically what we envision is that women who have completed conventional chemotherapy and are radiographically and clinically without evidence of disease, we know that, that, a, large, uh, that a significant por portion of these women will harbor micrometastatic disease that will go into form metastases. So what we envision is a test where we will be able to identify these women and identify specific markers associated with these cells and then be able to give these women targeted therapies to these cells. And so what we've done is we've developed, um, we've screened many, many genes, probably over 250 genes um, associated with breast cancer for expression in normal bone marrow. And of these genes, we found that approximately 44 of them have no expression in normal bone marrow. So these genes can be used so if these genes are expressed in bone marrow, then that means that they are associated with breast cancer cells. And so what we've done is we've taken this panel of genes and we've used them to, um, to determine if they are predictors of the development of metastatic disease. And that works currently under development. But it looks like we have a list of maybe seven genes which have targeted therapies um, that do predict metastatic disease development. So we're hoping in a validation set that we can confirm these results.